Hi, this is Mike with Montando Trailer, and this is our ADA Plus 2 Hydraulic Drop Trailer. Our trailer now features internal ducting throughout all the rooms. It also features adjustable heaters. However, if adjustability is not wanted, these caps can be removed and reinstalled with blanks. We have installed smaller toilet paper rollers. Our LED lights have been made tamper resistant as the switches have been disengaged. They can only be turned on or off from the utility room. For the ADA room, the toilet macerator is accessible from behind the toilet. Going into the utility room, we have our upgraded shelving, and we also have the stabilizers for the ramp. Here's your switch gear, your 12 volt converter, your extra outlets for phone charging, etc. And this is your charger. Switch it to on. It'll charge the battery. It takes approximately 24 hours for a full charge. You have your radio switch right here. This controls whether the radio is on or off. And this is the power button for the radio itself. If the trailer has not been used in a while or the pump isn't working correctly, it is a good idea to rebleed the system. This is easy to do. All you need to do is disconnect the water supply, then run the sinks until there is no more water pressure. After this, unscrew the top cap from the pump, refill it with water, reassemble, and the trailer is ready for use. Also, the shower macerator is accessible from behind the trailer. The power supply for the macerator is on the right. This is the fresh water connection. And this is the sight glass. With the switch set to forward, the hydraulics are on for both the front and back. When the switch is set to the side here, the hydraulics run only the front. Here's the generator in the cage, instructed to have the intake exposed as well as the exhaust the dump valve on the front and the new latches as requested for the propane tanks. The adapter cable for the generator is stored within the generator cage. The new locking system is actuated by turning the key 90 degrees. You then insert the reset key, remove the old key, insert the new key, and turn the key 180 degrees. Now the key is reset. The instructions for this are in the booklet inside the utility room. Also inside the utility room, you'll find the monitor for the backup camera. This can be installed into your truck, hooked into the wire coming off of the tongue, and the backup camera set to go. This has been Mike with Montando Trailer. Thank you for watching.